Hi, I'm Bruce, the inventor of the Slinger, and I'd like to talk to you today about golf's most important swing fundamental, the release. Ever since golf was invented in Scotland centuries ago, learning how to release properly has been a big mystery, and it is the number one swing fundamental that every golfer needs to know. Up till now, the only way to learn release was to take a swing with a club, let it fly, and hope that it goes down the center of the fairway, which would indicate you did release properly. However, if you do this a few times, there's a good chance you'll end up in small claims court or worse. I don't know if you can see this club, but on it, on the toe here, is a red arrow. This is very important. You will use this to go through the different slinger drills on our website and also to learn how to release properly. Okay, let's get started. What I've done here is set up a simple little repeatable practice area. On the wall back there you see a piece of masking tape. That's the foyer entrance to my house. On the floor I've used two inside moves, another product that I've developed. Um, this will give you a target line here and a stance line here. You should always practice smart if you want to improve. So set yourself up like this. Okay, we're ready to make our first swing. Take the ball. This is a lightweight plastic wiffle ball. Put it in the retainer here. Take your position here. This is my stance line. Here's my target line. Lines up with that piece of uh, masking tape. And then the drill. This is how easy it is to learn release. Just get, make a move like that. Get the club parallel to the ground, parallel to your target line. The head should be right about here, hip high. The face now the toe here with this red arrow right now is pointing straight up. That would be a good position, but it could actually be slightly shaded like this to match my spine angle. But you don't want to get in a position where you get to this height and your club is open. That will lead to a lot of bad things and it's hard to, you'll have to make it up in your swing somewhere along the line. So, the drill is just to get the toe up, like I just showed you. Make a pass at the ball, square yourself up like you would an impact. And in this area from 180 degrees, from here to here, all that good stuff will happen. You're going to go from toe up here, to square on the ball, to toe up here. All from here to here, hip to hip, waist to waist if you will. Let's see what happens when we do it. The object is to get in this position and hit the line. Again, this is all you need to do to learn how to release. It's that simple. Chicken winging. Oh gosh, uh, casting, everything goes away, and you'll hit the ball further, your drives will be longer. So again, here, simple up, toe up, make your move. There you go, toe up. What I'm trying to do is hit the line, or just slightly to the right of the line. Another swing. Very simple to do, very simple to learn. Once you know it, you know it. There you go. Make your move. And that's it. Learn that. Everything will change. Your game will dramatically improve. And you're going to like golf. You're going to love golf again. I invite you to visit our website at slingergolf.com. We have an expanding library of videos, photos, and everything by great teaching pros from all around the country. Videos that can help your golf game, not just related to the slinger, but just great videos to help improve your game. Please join us. Again, slingergolf.com. Well, that's it for now. I want to thank you very much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye.